Hey, what's going on, brothers and sisters in Christ? I am Chanel Marche, and if you're new to my channel, welcome. Today is July 23rd of 2021, and I want to talk about a dream that I had today, basically, because this was in the wee hours of the night, um, July 23rd of 2021. And in the dream, it was like I... This is this is um kind of hard to describe, but in the dream, it was like there was something going on with a group of us people who had the ability to see. And I was seeing different people who were gifted in the area to see what's going on in the spiritual realm and in the heavenly. I saw us because I saw myself and I saw all of the other people we were asleep but while we were sleeping there was something happening with our eyes where we could see a light in the darkness this is hard to describe but I'm going to try my best it was a light that we were able to see that was not the natural light that you would see with your naked eye. We were seeing a different type of light in the darkness and only those who had the gift to see were noticing this light and it was happening while we were in bed and while we were sleeping. And so, um, and we started working with each other and talking about it amongst each other. Hey, oh, you seen this too? You see that light as well? And we were just, you know, just, um, just talking about it, working together, sort of speak. And our lights, I don't want to say it attracted darkness, but our light irritated any place where we we would go that darkness would be exposed. And like, even if we stepped into a place where there was darkness, our lights never went out. Like we were always in the light and it's the dark that would make itself known or let it, it just would let us know that they're irritated by our light or the light exposed their darkness. It's hard to describe this, but this is what happened in, in the dream, what I was seeing. But our lights never went out. We never were overshadowed by darkness. Our light showed it up and I could see where there was a separation. There was a, there would be one place that's dark but then we were in the light. This is hard to describe. I hope it's making sense. But we were always in the light. Our light never went out and never dimmed. It was just ever so brightly. And so then I see a YouTuber and I watch this woman of God's videos from time to time. Her name is Shanika Byers here on YouTube. I saw her. Now, what's strange is when I saw her, I only, and I repeat, I only, her, her eyes were the only thing that was highlighted, okay? And when I saw her eyes, there was a design or pattern to highlight only her eyes. You know how like when you look through something, and the only thing that's exposed are the eyes. That's all I saw. I saw her eyes. And this pattern around her eyes only to highlight her eyes. And she was just looking. And it was like when she was looking it was like she could see everybody else who may have had just only their eyes 
highlighted. I don't know what that means, but I do watch a few of her videos. She is a woman of God. And I guess this means that God is going to heighten her level to see because because of the fact that I only saw her eyes being highlighted where she, only her eyes were showing that's it I didn't see her nose I didn't see her mouth I, that's all I saw were her eyes being highlighted with this pattern to what is the word I'm looking for the this pattern that made her eyes more pronounced it was it is so strange but i saw her but for her eyes to be highlighted like that and she's being used of god i guess the lord is going to height uh, heighten her ability to see because i know she is a prophet that hears from god but god is going to be doing something with her eyes as well because i saw them highlight highlighted so I, I believe that this is just a message to all of us who are seers, who can see and God communicates with us uh, through visions and dreams and to show us something visual that's about to be heightened and it's about to go to another level of sight and vision and ability to see. And we're going to be, I don't know in what shape, way, or form. When I saw only us who could see this light, this particular light, which is the light of God. Because like I said, you cannot see this light with your naked, through your naked eye, through the naked eye, the natural naked eye type of light. This was a different type of light that only the level of or the ability to see is heightened. That's the only way you'll be able to see it. And for us to be working together and talking about different things that we could see and sharing our gifts must means that must mean, excuse me, that we are going to come together some way, shape, shape or form and start working together. I don't know. But this is a message to all of us who are seers. God is about to take us to another level of sight through dreams and visions. It's, it's going to be heightened. So I thought that I would share this dream. I may have blessed someone and uh, guys just continuously stay prayed up. I'm excited what God is doing with all of us who belong to him. It doesn't matter your background. It doesn't matter who you are, where you are, how you were brought up. God can use who he will or whoever he chooses to use when he chooses to use them. We never should judge a book by its cover, but realize God always uses the unlikely people, the underdogs, so to speak, the people that you wouldn't think he would use to bring him glory. So Yes, you guys be blessed until the next time. Ciao and be easy. Bye-bye.